Santa Clara Unified School District also returned to campuses today, but for other districts, there was not even a set timeline. KPI X5's Devin Feely reports on the uneven pace of returning to the classroom. Over the next two weeks, students will return to classrooms in Santa Clara Unified School District, and many parents say it's something that couldn't happen soon enough. First and second graders were the first to return to campus, but the reopening plan will expand over the next week to include all grades like fifth grader Peter Plodick. I'm enjoying to be able to be in a classroom because I feel like that's where I work my best. Santa Clara Unified struck a deal with its teachers to return to the classroom and in-person learning when the county entered the orange tier, whether or not teachers had been vaccinated. In classrooms, we have uh, desk shields up for our students and everyone is six foot distanced. From, uh, from each other. Schools can be opened. A month ago, San Jose Mayor Sam Licardo urged school systems to accelerate their plans to get kids back into the classroom, especially in low-income neighborhoods. Now, since then, teachers have been fast-tracked for the vaccine, but despite that, the city's largest school system, San Jose Unified, won't open for another month until April 21st because its teachers have insisted on being fully vaccinated before returning to the classroom. What we've seen throughout the country that schools have safely reopened, particularly elementary schools, very safely reopened without vaccination of teachers. And the studies show it can certainly be done. Back in Santa Clara Unified, Peter's mom says she is grateful that he won't have to wait that long. Being away from their friends, from their teachers, and not being in a traditional classroom environment has been hard on them. By design, the school district has staggered the return to campus and the classroom, spacing it out over the next two weeks. Now, ultimately, the decision is left to parents and the acceptance of a return to in-person learning has varied widely across campuses. In Santa Clara, Devin Feely, KPIX 5.